Joey, how many hours of sleep did you get? Enough. How much is enough? Uh, probably around three hours or so. Oh, oh. All right. So Joey Button, financial advisor here at the Trinell Financial Group, is a new, no, you're not a new dad, second. Second dad. Second dad. New again. New, new again. again. So congratulations on the newest baby. How is she doing? Wonderful. She is eating everything in sight. And, That's uh, good. And growing and growing. Okay, awesome. So first and foremost, we're super excited to welcome another member to the Bunton family. So as you, you just had a baby, so this is your second one. Correct. Let's talk about 529s, Correct. right? First and foremost, okay, everyone throws out this number 529. We hear that a lot. What is a 529 plan? A uh, 529 plan is a state-sponsored college savings plan. Okay. And also, okay, fair enough. What are the benefits of a 529? You fund it with after-tax money. So that's money from wages or a business or from savings. Okay. And when you put it into the 529, it's invested mm -hmm. and it grows over time. And when you use that money for qualified expenses, such as tuition, room and board, um, computer for school, that mm -hmm. sort of thing, books, um, oh, okay. you're able to access it tax free. Okay. So if you put in $1,000 and it grows to be $3,000 and you use that money for a qualified expense, that $2,000 worth of growth is tax-free and you've already paid taxes on the first $1,000. Okay, and so you just had a child. Correct. Did you start your 529 plan? Let's get personal <laughs> for a second. Did you start your 529 plan right away? When's the best time to? So Ari was born in December and February 1st was the first contribution into her 529 plan. Okay, so start early is what you're telling me. Yeah, so the value of time, right? So okay. um, Warren Buffett says the, the reason that he's been so fortunate and, and done what he's done is being born in America and the power of um, compound interest. Okay. So if you're going to set a certain period of time that you're going to invest for your child's college, mm -hmm. um, it, let's say you're going to invest for five years. Okay. There's a big difference between investing from year zero to year five and investing from year 13 to year 18. Right. So you might put the exact same amount of money in, but if you put that money in you know, in the five years prior to the kid going off to college, it's not going to have the value of time. It's not going to be able to grow in the market the way it would have had you put it in uh, from age zero to age five. Mm -hmm. And so uh, you don't get that tax-free benefit quite as much. You'll get some growth on what you put in five years out and four years out and three years out, but not near as much of that tax-free growth as if you had a much longer runway. So the value of time is very important. Starting early, if you can, is the way to go. Okay, awesome. Well, that's awesome, so thank you. If you have, if you just had a child, right? Newly found family or anything of that nature, let us know. Obviously, it's better to start earlier, actually in any situation, right. even for retirement as well. Right. It's going down that route too. Starting earlier is better, right? Yeah. Even if it's just a little bit as we go. So an additional benefit this time of year, yeah. in tax season, um, not all states offer it, but in the state of Illinois, in the state of Wisconsin, and in a few other states, you're able to deduct your 529 contributions off of your state income tax as well, um, up to a certain level. So in the state of Illinois, um, up to $10,000 if you file single, up to $20,000 if you file jointly. You do not get a federal credit or a federal deduction, but you get to deduct any 529 contributions off of your state income tax, in some states, not in all. I did not know that. That's brand, I also, Here to help. Ah, okay, awesome, that's like news to me, wow. Okay, not that that applies to me, but in the future, yes. it could apply to me. It applies to me and I'm happy for it. Exactly. All right, well thank you so much, Joey. I appreciate your time. Best of luck, hopefully getting some more sleep, obviously. Uh, one day. Um, but thank you so much, have a great day.